Hi everyone, so my name is Venetia and if you're watching this, you probably watched my first video. So if you did, thank you so much for watching it because it really means a lot to me. I basically decided that I want to start vlogging or creating kind of a video diary thing um, on YouTube. I basically just want to use it to raise awareness of issues, use it as my medium of um, communicating with others, people I know, people I don't know. Today I wanted to kind of talk to you about um, who I am and basically make it clear that I wasn't always volunteering and I wasn't always so um, civically active. I basically started volunteering in grade 8 and that was after I saw a Because I Am A Girl com commercial when I was in grade 7 on TV and it basically did change my life. So I was watching TV and I saw this commercial and I was like, wow, this is so cool. I want to find out all about it. I went online, found out some information, got in contact with them, and I told them that I wasn't old enough to be a part of their Girl Speakers Bureau, which is basically a group of girls who are trained by Plan Canada. They go out to events and conferences to speak out on girls' rights and why it's important to pay attention to the plight of girls around the world. So I thought it was amazing, but I, I was a little too young to join it. And so I contacted them and I was like, what can I do? And they were like, well, just wait until you're 14 and then apply. And I was like, but I want to do it now. So I kept emailing them and then I was I figured I could just apply anyways. So I applied and then I kept emailing them after I, I applied, asking them if they got my application. And then I got a reply in grade 8 and they said, you know what, come and join us for a meeting and I was ecstatic. I went into the conference room in this huge building and I was totally intimidated because there was a bunch of amazing young women who were so intelligent and I was like, how am I supposed to fit into this? How am I supposed to feel normal? And it was interesting and it's an ironic that I felt that way because right now, every time I go into a Girl Speakers Bureau meeting, I feel in a place where I could be myself the most. It's really the only place I can be around a bunch of people and still feel comfortable with what I'm saying. It was basically, my time to realize that I had power within, with my voice. There was so much wrong in the world that we had the power to change. And it was basically a, a huge awakening for me. So I decided to start volunteering, start going to events and conferences and speaking about girls' rights. And honestly, my life has been surreal ever since I decided to do that. I'm a bit older now and Thinking back to how it all got started, I can't even remember who I was before the Girl Speakers Bureau came in, into my life. Right now, I'm not just volu volunteering for Because I'm a Girl, I'm a part of other groups and clubs inside my school and outside, and it's honestly been amazing. Basically, what I'm trying to say is I was totally intimidated, and then I found out that, that the Girl Speakers Bureau was the right place for me to be. You have to be put yourself in a position where you think you feel vulnerable and see how things turn out. And that's the only way you can really be sure of yourself and um, prove to yourself that you are capable. So thank you so much for watching. I hope this was much easier to watch than the other video because the other video was pretty long. Thank you.